Okay. Well, now the the the, the best known uh, is uh, the newest is uh, Tatsuba. Okay, and uh, all the five uh, five years ten years before is uh, Elisa. All this one made the people feel good. You know, one of the writer I read the, in the in the newspaper, one of the writer in you know, American writer take the eraser uh, for the lung cancer. After she take it for 14 days, uh, she said that she can stand up and then write again the things. But if you follow this lady's history, six months later, you get a fire. Where do you go? To the hell or to heaven, we don't know. <laughs> but anyway, that's what they happened. But when they make noise, they see that she this writer can lay it on the uh, agony uh, on, uh, on the bed, but now she can stand up, she can walk in, she writing again. So wow, big news. Uh, in TV, in newspaper, everywhere, even I I'm so busy I still can read the, the news, okay? That uh, when I read the news and everything, then my inner she telling me. She will soon die very soon. My image is just telling me like that, okay? She will die very soon. But I still very hopeful that she can live better. But unfortunately, after six months, no news at all. Okay. Now, at this trip, in this trip in China, I go to a, to a city. One, this, uh, they have to do everything. This uh, have a liver, liver cancer liver cancer. Operating, they cut off, and then they do chemo. Doctor say that, I can tell you, young man, 39 years old, and um, you have no more cancer cell in your body. No more cancer in you. But, so, few months later, they ask me to follow up. Because they, the doctor tell them, ah, now they have no more cancer, but they can come back any time. Right? You believe that? Yeah, sure, everybody, I believe it. But I teach you the way, you don't need to believe. You become your own doctor. You know that they will come back or not, okay? But the way they do, I know they will come back. And then, uh, so the doctor tell the truth, it's true. Three months or so later, the cancer come back. The doctor said that, well, before you have one now they eat in other area in the also in the liver, but before there's one tumor, now they have two tumor. So we need to put a higher dose of chemo of surgery first, okay, and then chemo. So they do again and then doc, this time doctor say that then the cancer have to destroy all the cancer cells. The cancer cells won't come back anymore. But you need to follow up to make sure. And then so back and forth, back and forth, five times, operation. And then until the end of the five months, one of his friends, yeah. Huh? My wife, auntie. Auntie, yeah, how can you put it bigger? Yeah, because I'm not tradition. <laughs> I don't know how. <laughs>
okay. Yeah. This might have a script because their part, their part is Chinese, okay. Their part is Chinese. Yeah. They, but the English is their upper. Yeah, I have an English then Chinese, and English then Chinese. Anyway, that the uh, expert to do it, which I continue. I won't spend too much for this kind of Western treatment, okay? Because I just they will know the same scenario, what they do, okay? What they do, okay? After five times of, of uh, operation and uh, and uh, chemo, then uh, the patient receive uh, one of my book, the natural healing. You have the first book? No, he didn't bring, it, okay? The uh, the book, and then he read it. He read the book. Then uh, he follow exactly the book, and only forty days. Then uh, the, at this time, when the when the sixth time the cancer come back, okay, he didn't do anything. He follow exactly the book for only forty days, and then he's rushed to look to see. I follow forty days, very strictly for one hundred percent. Is uh, the book say that to see how the result. And then uh, at that time, on the sixth, on the on the sixth time, the cancer come back. The cancer is in the liver, spread to the lung and to the bones. Okay. And the first thing that when they after forty days, the young man go to to check the bone. <coughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, and uh, the cancer then uh, so that we can move up with a little bit, okay, and, okay, uh, okay, and then look a little bit, okay. and then so forty days, the doctor could not see anything in the lung, in the bones, and they say that then maybe they reduce back to the liver. This should be there. That three tumor should be there. They look at there, nothing there. And when this young man tried to contact me, what that time in Hong Kong, they, he fly all the way to Hong Kong, so happy. I said, no, no, no fly here. Before you come, make a blood test. Go to hospital, go to the blood test. To the, what I require you to see later on. To know you really, you are not dependent on me. You are not dependent on the doctor. The doctor said that you have no more. That I cannot see. No more is because they cannot see. The CT scan cannot see. The person cannot see. That is not the hill. The hill you really need to know is know the cancer marker. You know the cancer marker. And when the cancer marker is from your blood, in your blood say no cancer. What is the number you should read? Zero. Who says zero? Who? Who? You say zero? You smart guy. Oh, you're, you're Chinese? Okay, you're Chinese, okay. <laughs> okay. We have exchanged the idea. You feel, you think it is zero, you should say, say. Okay, you should say, zero. Yeah, you should say, zero. If you, you can't see anything. So what is that? Zero. Okay, you should say, zero. Okay, so when they come, okay, I see those markers, not zero. So I tell them, the cancer, why? I say that, you know why? You will have a five time operation and chemo. And why the, the doctor tell you the cancer will come back? Because they never check this uh, cancer marker. How they know you are? They cannot see. That is, they cannot see because the, 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 the sophisticated equipment cannot see. It doesn't mean the, the cancer is not there. It's the same thing. You cannot see God. You cannot deny God is here. I know all the time God is beside me when I talk. So that's why I believe He is beside me in order to protect me. So in 44 years in America, practice, I don't get any trouble like, uh, uh, like Dr. John, uh, Jonathan Wright, you know him? Okay, Dr. Don Bash, you know him? Okay, they all get trouble with them. I don't. Because God protects me. Because I all the time glorify Him. Okay, yeah. And then uh, that's why I'm healed. That's why I'm healed. Because uh, I all the time say the glory thing, glory him. That's why although I'm 30 years, uh, when I was 30 years old, last stay of lung cancer, doctor say, well, you have only a few months to live. If you 
you, you want to do something, live longer. I said, who don't want to live longer? Do you want to live longer? <laughs> yeah. Do chemo. So if people say that, yeah, do you want to go? Surely you want. But I ask, how long? At least four months. <laughs> yes, four years we do. Four months? Forget. <laughs> okay? And because this is forget, now I'm over 70. See that? That's what we have to make a good decision. Okay, something. Okay, now um, we go further. Okay. Okay, yeah. So, the, this is the, the people all the time ask where I can contact you. Okay, so now I have no more than car. Yeah. Because I'm poor. Can you afford it? Okay, now the Western, the Western weapon, uh, the, the, the Western weapon is, uh, before is a free, a uh, free, uh, very powerful weapon to take care of the cancer patient, but uh, made uh, cancer people all the time um, go, oh, the, the, the survival rate is five years. And then they go, what they, the slogan say? Earlier detection, earlier treatment. Who believe in these things? Raise your hand. No? Oh, you are all genius. <laughs> I tell you, it's what they say. This is the real statistic from the British Medical Journal, Lancet. Lancet, okay? A, uh, L A N C E T. Lancet? Okay, Lancet. Yeah. Yeah. The right up. The breast cancer, they find out earlier and they do the treatment. The survival rate is a five year. Okay? They are talking about not the first stage. The first stage, uh, you can live forever. But the, survival, the first stage, if you follow what I'm talking today, you don't need to do anything and you live forever. So in other words, you save a lot of money and a lot of sufferings. Okay? But we are talking about those uh, third stage. Okay, third, uh, third stage. Now this one, they say more than five years. And then, but the lady, they don't, they don't do anything. The survival rate is two years. So when you hear like this one, which way you want to go? Tell you, fact, happily, truly, you what you want. You want to live five years or you want to live two years? Tell me two. Five years, right? Okay. Now, now let me explain what, what the, the real story, okay? Earlier detection. So they made the mammogram, they find out something. So from the time they find out something, that is the uh, you start the treatment. Okay? And then they do the lumectomy, they say no more. One year, two years later, they come back again, then they do again, they do again, and finally they do everything. Five years you die. You do nothing. You 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 also don't find anything. You say, oh I, I find nothing, so I don't worry about. Okay, but actually, if you don't memo, they will see something. But you because you don't do memo, you don't believe in memo. Because maybe it's a, a squeeze sandwich, you know? And then that's why you squeeze and the, they, they poke up the, the cancer cell, you know, and spread all over, okay? So this lady is smart, no more to do, okay? But then for the third year, for the third year, they find out lung. And now, this time they're scared. They go to check. And then they do biopsy, they say, that's a malignant. Okay, and then so they get to do chemo, you need to do the lumpectomy or mastectomy, okay, but they do, okay? And then, only two year treatment, so they die. die. So, there's one this lady, if you, not early detection, okay, so you, you only two years to live. If you have early detection, you have five years to live. Now, tell me which way you want to live now. You want two years, you want five years. Huh? You change the mind. You want two years. Why? Because in this 
In this first year to third year, you know nothing. You live locally, you enjoy your life. You don't spend any money. But this lady, early detection, early treatment, go to spend the money for lumpectomy, for third chemo, for everything. Okay? And then at the end of five years, bankruptcy. And this lady spent two years, not bankruptcy. Right? This is how they count the surviving rate. Early detection, early treatment. Okay? Actually, which one live happier? Both will die. That's why the license said both will die. But one died without suffering. Stop, no, with the suffering, but without much suffering. Then the early detection. Okay, now you know how they count the studies count. Okay? Okay, now we don't spend too much time to tell you how they made this one to survive later, okay? And now they after they do everything, they cannot do anything else. And they say that uh, well, most of all cancer patient family, we say, oh, pretty good, you have any way to help. Okay, now, we, how about we use a trial medicine, okay? Maybe it work, maybe not, but uh, it seems to work very good for some people, okay? Seems very good for some people. But yeah, that's true, okay? That's true, yeah. So, they give you chemo. And then you take it, one, that's a real story in China. But the lady take it for just seven days. It's a, she is almost dying, cannot even eat, cannot even walk, lay down on the bed. And then um, the family bank doctor do something, you know, okay, then they put the expensive drug, oral. And then only the day take it, same day, she can walk, she can eat, she can do anything. Everybody enjoy the oh, this miracle! This miracle! Doctor said that wow, that I, I cannot even believe that this this uh, the trial medicine is so effective. Okay, uh, okay, I'm the name Taseva. Okay, yeah, I'm sure what I'm okay, but okay. so effective. But then seven days later, two tumors show up in the in the brain. And the lady coughing, coma, a coma, and now until now still coma. And then the family, I don't know all this because the family now read the book. I had to find out the books. So they find the book and they ask publisher, know the address, the call, get no, no answer, email, no answer. Okay, and then they know that. I'm still in China, so they fly over there, okay, and then I hope I can help them. Okay, I say that. Really, really. Too, too late. Okay, too late. So that uh, I, uh, I uh, refuse to take it, but I tell them, I need the blood test to know it's real or late or not. Okay, and, but you don't need you write this book, all the blood tests, all those cancer marker, all those cancer marker is in the back. That's Chinese, okay, so you can read it. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, so now the a lot of people go to traditional traditional Chinese. Uh, those uh, they like uh, those people they get like, you come to the tent. They say, oh, there's another way. No, they said they have uh, to do the chemo radiation. So they how about both the Chinese? They take the Chinese herb, find the Oriental medical doctor, find the Chinese herb, acupuncture, uh, twina massage, twina is one kind of massage. Okay, yeah, and qigong you do your practice. Okay, one of them will work, or all of them will work better. Okay, and then and that too. The survival rate is much higher without much suffering, but at the at the agony time, still suffering a lot. But at least uh, you are living more comfortable at home. More comfortable. Okay. So, so that uh, when you have a cancer, you know that there's another way. Traditional Chinese medicine. Okay. Which way is better? 
Uh, why Chinese people, the TCM, the traditional Chinese people, come from China? Why the Chinese people don't believe in Chinese treatment? They believe in Western uh, treatment. <laughs> That's made me so mad, you know? Yeah. So many foreigners everywhere I go to South Asia, to India, to everywhere, they all glorify the Oriental medicine. And why the Chinese don't appreciate the Chinese medicine? Okay. Because the Western uses CT scan, F scan, MI, all oh, this is a scientific, sophisticated equipment, equipment to prove it. You, you have cancer, it's a benign or benign, but the Chinese doctor cannot know you are, you, you, you have tumor, you go to them, okay, we try to adjust the area and cleanse your body to, to know it, but they don't know, is it benign or benign? Benign or malignant? Do, do you really care about benign or malignant? Do you really care? For me, benign or malignant is the same thing. It's an abnormal of the normal cell. So it's the same thing. Except that, that benign is a grow small, slower. Malignant grow faster. That's the only thing. You both have, you both have to die anyway. Only when you get no tumor, then you are survived. Like me, for 45 years, the cancer never did dare to touch me. Okay, we will tell you why. Okay, yeah. Okay, so, because they, this kind of sophisticated and the biopsy, they, they analyze it, knowing that this malignant is not, is benign. So they, 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 if they can know it, that you will not malignant, so that's a better treatment. So they tend to. That's why they induce them to go to chemo or surgery, and they don't believe they follow. But finally, the result is there, okay? Yeah. And the human gravity too, okay? Yeah. Okay. Now, the TCM is non-invasive, non-invasive, okay, non-invasive. And then uh, they use uh, acupuncture. Well, they need to like uh, mosquito sting a little bit, so there's not, not much suffering, uh, no much suffering. And, uh, Qigong, you already learned this morning, very easy, <laughs> right? Or any kind of or jumping around, right? This is your easy. Okay. Yeah, so that's why. So you, you, you people try to think it, okay? It's Chinese, okay? But go to another way, go away. <laughs> okay, yeah. okay. Okay. So why? You go to Chinese medicine, that's better. But still, we die. We live longer, more comfortably, but at the end of cancer, all the time, very suffering. Also, still suffering and die, but suffering less than Western medicine. And uh, we won't put you in bankruptcy. Okay, you have no family burden because the herbs are expensive. Okay, they are expensive. And the herbs, it's God, but in the Bible, God recommended the herbs for the healing of the nation. The herbs for the healing of the nation. The nation, we have many nations in our body. Five nations, five big nations, all good. Okay, yeah. Okay, so that's why the herb. The Chinese usually told me know this concept. But what's wrong? Both of them die. Why come those no, no, no any? Any treatment can survive because the, the both uh, modality, both uh, treatment, both uh, medicine, go for the treatment. They go for the, when you have a tumor, when you have cancer, they go for the treatment. The body not need the cancer treatment. The body don't need treatment. The body need the nutrition, need the right food. The body need the nutrition, need the right food. You're lacking this food. That's why you get a problem. And you eat the wrong food, then um, make your body cannot function properly. And then when you eat the wrong food, then you get a blockage. And the Chinese try to, to use meridian, acupuncture to adjust meridian. So that's the correct way. But then they go for treatment to adjust it without finding out why we have cancer. They don't go to ask why. The Western 
Medicine don't ask why. The Chinese medicine also don't ask why. They only try to adjust the radiant. That's good part. But unfortunately, when you adjust it, to, and then after adjust it, you go home, you, you take a little hamburger again, a little again, and then uh, to a little French chip, French fry, and then uh, uh, the, the, your next month you go to there, oh, they, they cook again, they broke again, and then you go to adjust again. So still, you spend the money, although it's inexpensive, but you get the money, and you get the time to go there. Okay, so both of them concentrate with the treatment. Okay, well, when the treatment, that's why. Okay, now, when you have to ask why you get cancer, people get cancer because of the blood, too much toxin in the blood. That's what we call toxemia. Too much toxin in the blood. Where this toxin come from? You have to ask. Them. When you know that, that now you know. So you're in, when you have cancer in your tumor, you don't know, rush, you don't need to rush. That this young man, 39 years old, five times more of liver operation and chemo, then then in 40 days, all is fear. And myself, I don't eat a little bit, but surely after he get the, uh, the blood test come to me, I tell him, you are not yet healed, okay? But surely, it's a, it's a hero forever, okay? Yeah, because of you're done, okay? But uh, one thing surprised me, because in my practice, I never see that the, a spray cancer, we call metastasis, can heal in 40 days. That means the CD can have to get a seed, you know? Yeah, except the blood test can. Okay, yeah. It's surprising me. Now, I go deeper into investigation. This young man is the grower of the organic food. Is the grower of the organic food. So that she, you know, he, he follow my diet. He don't, he have liver cancer, but he don't look at the liver cancer. He look at the way I'm eating. Because in the book, they tell the way I'm eating. I eat, I'm eating the exactly what God recommended in the Genesis chapter 1, verse 29. Eat all the vegetable, all the vegetable with the seed on the surface of the globe, of the earth. And the fruit yielding the seed on the tree, okay, for your meal, for your meal. So I followed that way for six months. Cancer is bitter. Three more months, nine months, total recover. Okay, and until now, still the same thing. Except a little, still a little weak in the breathing system. That's why sometimes I see I have to pray. Not allergy, it's a little, when it's a little exciting, or you get mad, you think they do it. Ah, I feel yeah, exciting. <laughs> so, and uh, so you will see that once when you, this young man can heal so fast because of organic food. Okay? So now you know the difference. Because I don't even believe, because in my practice, 40 years, more than 40 years, natural healing, I never see some people so good so far. Four months, yes, but not 40 days. And this young man, 40 days this year. But surely he's not yet here after the blood test show me, okay? I shall tell, explain to him, okay? Yeah. Okay, yeah. but the blood test, he's not the explanation, and with my explanation, totally different. He's the doctor after the blood test. And those blood tests, they, they don't know how to interpret it, but they test it. And this young man asked him, what this test means? He said that means that everything is normal. Okay, normal. So the young man said, Doctor Wu, everything is normal, you know? I said, let me see. I said, everything is not normal. None of them is normal. Okay, and later I will tell you why. Okay? And then we we'll continue. Okay. So so that the first thing is you need to eat food the much. Why you get the toxemia is that when you put in something in your mouth, which food don't match with the, the, your blood type, then you get trouble. So that you have to eat the food that match with the, your blood type. For example, you are A, you are A, and then uh, you A, you don't know what is the A, what they did them A, what they did B, what they did them O. Do you know why? I tell 
about you now. You know, you become expert in the future. Okay. <laughs> a means uh, the flood, the descendant of Adam. 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 So what God tell Adam to eat? All the vegetable on the surface of earth. So that if if that's the recommendation of God. So that you say I eat a lot of vegetables, but I put in the wall. I go in the wall, I still I stir fry it. Is it on the earth or on the wall? <laughs> so what God said, you have to eat one hundred percent raw. Yes. If you are blood type A, okay, A. I that God said that surface of okay, yeah. If you are cancer, but if you have no cancer, you just want to follow the God's uh, uh, commandment, but you don't want to to put in the surface. You want to eat in the wall. That's okay too. If you have no cancer, but if you do have cancer, of tumor, benign of the dinner, no cyst, small cyst, no matter wherever the cancer or where the cyst. You need to eat 100% as God recommended, and for nine months, and they until that the CT scan, PET scan, can see, and the blood test prove that it's zero. Then at that time, once uh, once uh, per week or two times per week, you want to eat some fish, some egg. That's okay. Why okay? You are blood type A, not supposed to eat any animal protein. Why okay? <coughs> because the body is have a two wonderful healer inside. These two healer, one is the immune system. Another healer is the healing system. One attack the enemy, one clean up uh, the debris. Okay. So they have a two healer inside your body. That two here is the best doctor in the world. That's why I believe the two best doctor. But these two best doctor need what? Need the right food you eat. So you need to eat according to your blood type. Okay. But that's A. If you are O, O, why O? O is a descendant, descendant of Noah. Any people here have a Greek descendant? Any people here, American, American, Caucasian, have a descendant from a Greek? I'm an uh, Maybe you're not. You, no, you're not. If you took a Greek, it should be Greek people. The Greek people, the N, Noah, N, N is Omega. Okay? N, Noah. So you are descendant of Omega, so you are blood type Noah, you are blood type O. Why O? Now you know why. Okay? Noah. And Noah, God permit him to eat meat. Because what? Flood. No way to cultivate it. No way to eat vegetable. That's why in Genesis chapter 9, verse 3, God said that you can eat all the animals. They go around in your bottle about the, the earth. But don't forget, even that, don't forget the earth. God still say that you need to eat the herb. Okay, that's one the all. Okay, and then uh, so the all people need to eat some animal protein. A lot of people. So I people follow my diet is not a vegetarian diet. It's a, you have to eat according to your body's need. Okay, body's need. Okay, and then after the flood, after the flood. Okay, now. The flood, people bring the, the animal, the best shows, the best show, right? Best show, best, the best show, animal, get okay? measure, B, huh? B, the best show, down, okay? And people know how to cultivate the, the grain, right? The grain, so they made the bread, everything, right? So these people are the can eat the bread, right? So now they, God said that, well, I change you to the brother so that you can eat bread, you can eat the animal, okay? The, the best. So they get the bee. Okay, and they go to how to do the business. So they get the bee, O B, okay, B B B. Okay, yeah. Okay. Okay. And then bees when you do business, they go far away, like a lot of people you have to go to China to make business, right? Now even internet you still have to go to sign a contract, right? So you have to go. And then they stay there, they see a bank, you go over there. 
and then they have prostate A, and they get married, and then so they get AB. Okay, so that's what they have. Okay, AB are the newest blood type. Okay, yeah. so now you have to eat according to your my my uh, my book have write down all the blood types, and then when you read the book, you have to read intelligently. We don't. Some of people say that a blood type O, you need to eat blood type A, you need to eat animal. Or some or you are the oldest blood type is O. Older blood type is what? Now you need, you know. A, right? God created Adam. God tells Adam today. So God from the older blood type is the A. But some people write O. But you read it, it's good. You read it and you exchange thinking by yourself. Everything you're thinking and you know it. You don't object that this is wrong. No. Eat it. So you accept people's idea and then you analyze which one is wrong, which is right. Okay, yeah. And then uh, you won't get problem. Alright. Yeah. So it, second thing, when you eat the wrong food, the body, the detoxified organ, we have a all the food we eat will first go to the liver for detoxification. And then uh, when you take the, any kind of drug, medication, or the wrong food you eat, or alcohol you believe is good, the red wine you believe is good, all this what you believe is good is no good at all. The red wine, because it's the alcohol. It made the, it made the extra burden for the liver. Okay? And, uh, and uh, why, why everybody promote the red wine? Commercial, Commercial interest. Okay, and then the two people all have been buying in. We will have a go and courage to take some wine, some red wine. Okay, yeah, we don't go too, too much about this one, but I tell you, all the alcohol are bad. Okay, but once a while in the new year, in Christmas time, at that time, you take one shot or two shot, no problem. This, this Bible, God permitted. God only gave the example. Where? In a marriage. Maria, our God, our Jesus, Christ of God. Tell, tell Jesus. No more. No, no more wine. So God tell to bring me six bottle of six can of water. And then he changed all to wine. In which occasion? Marriage. So in the festival. So when you have festival time, you enjoy a little bit. It's no problem. Okay? No problem. Okay, yeah. Okay. But no other time. Okay? And then all the wrong food we eat give a lot of burden to the liver. And the liver cannot make up all right, cannot detoxify. The liver is the organ, very powerful detoxified organ. They can detoxify everything. But something wrong with it, they can detoxify. But something that they never can detoxify is they eat. They cannot recognize. Because to be recognized, they have to eat from ancestor to ancestor. The food, you know. And what the liver can recognize is the food that created by God. Because God tells them, and we eat it, we taste something good. Like now, I tell you to eat young berry. Your people there not to eat young berry. You dare not to eat the young berry. The red color, young berry, drop too much you know, on the floor, on, the, on the, the one of the church, uh, uh, the, um, my, my friend over there invited me to there. When I see it, all the floor drops so much, I get, a, get me a bag. And I tell my wife, get it all together to me. Okay? And then after I get everything, they ask me, oh, what food is for? I said, this is good for heart. This is good for preventing cancer. 100 times better than blueberry. Okay, 100 times better than cranberry. Okay, than cherry, cherry, cherry berry. How is this so good? And the people try to, to go to grab it, but I grab first, okay? So, <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, if I tell first, then I have nothing. Okay, but my courtesy, I have to let the people take it, right? And then I know that you, you don't want it, right? Okay, I take it. Okay? I think the people don't want it. And then I tell the story. Okay, yeah. And then when I say this word, if here I have somebody grow the young berry, 
Now they know, they are smart, they will become rich, okay? Now, uh, the one small boxes of blueberries sell to $2.99, this one maybe sell $4.99, and then you will soon the rich, okay, yeah? So, the, the cause, when you wrong cause, the gallbladder cleansing. So you need, in my book, I tell you, you do four day gallbladder cleansing. Four day gallbladder cleansing. We have no time to get developed wrong, okay? Yeah, we, we have to control the time, okay? Yeah, um, okay, and then, the slow bowel movement. The conventional belief is a one bowel movement is good. Who has one bowel movement? Raise your hand. <coughs> you have a two, raise your hand. You have a three, raise your hand. You have four, raise your hand. Oh, good. Four. Okay. I maintain to have four bow every day. When you read the book about one and one sick day, I have a six or seven time. I scare me to death, you know? But I read the one, yeah, no, oh, I really scared. I said, oh, one, one bow is good. I know I have a six or seven time. That's bad, you know? But that's the way of intoxication. And that's why, the word, although I'm dead, I get skinner, but I get more energy. Oh, I said, maybe that's a good way, okay? And then it do. And then, so, I can take that six times, and then come with five times, and then come four times. And then stay there for four times forever, until now. Okay, so, the bowel mover is it. It's the detoxification the best. You have to consider your color as a cleansing organ, a detoxified organ. Don't put the, your color as a cesspool. You put a cesspool, you get trouble. You get colon cancer, and you get lung cancer. Okay, when you have a colon, when you have a, 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 a one bowel every two days, then sooner or later, you get either colon cancer or lung cancer. That's two. Okay, yeah. And, uh, and uh, the, the concept is a uh, convention doctors. Uh, Sometimes uh, it's, uh, I don't know why, one of the ladies, 75 years, come to me, and then I said, uh, when they come to com uh, complaining, uh, have a polyps, okay, polyps, and doctor want to operate on her, and then she said no. Then we find out another way, and then the, and, uh, she had to come to region like this, all the look around, and then finally come fly all the way to, to North East in the South, from South San Diego, come all over there, and then uh, spend the money. The old lady, 75, agreed to spend pay the every, everything, go there to see me, okay? And it's, it's not cheap. When you see me half an hour, how much? 300 dollars, okay? But only one time, okay? You see me only one time, okay? Half an hour, 300 dollars, no less, okay? Yeah, okay, now, she come, on, oh, what happened? I am not familiar with this, okay? Don't play the job with me. <laughs> yeah, and then, okay, okay. Okay, now, and then, uh, he said, I said, how, how many pounds you have day? Oh, my doctor even said that I'm very good. Every Friday at 9 a.m., he comes. <laughs> he said, my doctor said that you are so wonderful. <laughs> I said, yeah, I said, that's true. You are so wonderful, that's why you get polyps. You want to get polyps, you need to have four power. Then I have diarrhea. I said, no. You, have, you need four power, but not diarrhea. Okay? Okay, that's what we say. The very important for. And then the raw beverage, we already talk, okay? We need to drink distilled water or osmosis water, the good water. Okay? Yeah. And uh, the way of wrong cooking. Why are Americans so sick? And every country they get friends with the America, like Mexico, they follow America. The Mexicans so healthy in the countries. They're poor, but they are healthy, no sickness. But when they are so cruel with the American country, with the USA, they are so sick. And what they have American have? And cancer, they have cancer, heart disease, they have heart disease, they have a high blood pressure, they have everything now. Why? Because the fast food. Fast, fast food. I, I cannot name, uh, name the name, okay? Yeah, okay, you know why I say it, okay? Yeah, okay. So that's why all the fast food have why? Big, 
grill, deep fry, okay, yeah, fancy fry, potato chip, okay, uh, fried chicken, okay, all fry, okay, all fry, okay, all this the wrong way of cooking, because God tells you to eat the, on the surface of the raw, not fried, and you eat the wrong way, and then that's why you get trouble, okay, and we eat the filthy animal protein, filthy animal protein, you say that, oh, Dr. Wu, no, no, I don't eat filthy protein, I eat the organic salmon. I tell you one thing, with my own experience, there's one day I go to a, oh, I don't mention the, the store name, okay? I, I, mean, I go to a, a store, buy the organic egg. And, and you know that, you know, maybe this beneficial for both of you too, all of you, okay? Yeah. Buy the organic egg. But I'm... Before, I very 100% trust in all the food they sell in a, in a health food store. Because they all put it conventional food or organic food. They put down, right? And then they put organic eggs. Sorry, I grab it, I buy it. But my mind telling me, Dr. Wu, eat the way you always do. So my wife don't do that way. But my, I always do the way, so God tell me to do that way, so I do. I, my way is like boiling hot, hot boil, hot boil the egg, hot boil. And then after hot boil, I say this is organic. Organic food means that the egg yolk, what color should be the egg yolk? Yellow. Orange. Say, yellow. What do you say? If you are the real organic, the egg, uh, egg, egg yolk should be yellow. But when I open it, one side is gray, another side is black. I bring the six cook with the six another cook without cook to the to the store. But when you bring like that, they will give a lot of you So I put out my name, this uh, and this name. They read it, and now they respect me. Okay, I say that my research tell me the organic egg yolk should be yellow. Do you believe that? He said, yeah, it should be yellow. Egg yolk should be yellow. I said, but now it's gray and black. I don't know what happened. I know you are not trying to treat me, but you was treated by the supplier. So it's not you, it's the supplier. So you need to complain to the supplier. Okay, to the supplier. It's wrong. I said, can you tell me if it's a yellow one, why half is a gray, why half is a black? Tell me why. I said, okay, since you ask for that, for your knowledge, I tell you. The gray color is the color of the lid. You know the pen, the pencil? What color? Gray color. And how about the, the black? The black color is the arsenic. Arsenic. And then all the chicken, all the conventional chicken, they are feeding animal feed with the arsenic in there. Because arsenic mimic hormone, make the the drinking grow fast. Okay, and you know how dangerous is arsenic and the lead. Both you then your brain cell. And then people, I try to eat organic egg because I want to be a smart people. I don't want to be, finally, at old age, I have to become, hey, what's your name, Papa? Huh? My name? <laughs> My name? <laughs> okay, become outside. Yeah, and this one, I, why I eat the hard boy egg. Yeah. And then, uh, wow, well, that manager, Really bad. Put up the phone. I said, don't need, don't need put up here. You mean? I just educate you. You talk to them later on. Smile. Love it. Ha ha ha. So we love it. Okay. Love it me. And then I, I go. She said that, Doctor, I'd like to refund, re, refund you back the money. I said, no, no. I come here to educate you. We are help more people. Okay. I am not come to, to take back the money. Okay, but they you take something back, you know, to recover your money. I said, oh, okay, I like the pressure nut. So, and then she asked me, why 
you like the Brazil nut, you know the almond walnut? I said, oh, I love Brazil nut, you know, tastes good, tastes taste like a coconut, you know, I love it, okay? And then uh, I said, you know why? He said, that, oh, I, I, I heard about a lot of uh, Brazil nut is good, but uh, what's, what's good, doctor? You know why, why good Brazil nut? Huh? What? Say something. Selenium. Very high in selenium. Organic selenium. And selenium is a cancer killer. But too much if you kill your liver. So how much we should eat? Each place you not have about 50 micrograms. So our body needs about 250 micrograms. So about how many brazil nuts we eat? Five. Five. Okay. So you can eat from five to six or seven, no problem. Okay. Or even eight, eight, no problem. But no, do not jump over eight. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. A little more, no problem, because the brazil nuts, some are the bigger, some smaller, smaller, yeah, less. Okay. So don't worry. Okay. Yeah. But don't overdo. Okay. And then, but you are very. Imagine that sometimes a cancer patient comes to me and say, take 10 or 12 of a Brazil nut. Okay? And why? Because they need more. Okay? Yeah. So that. But this is what, what you are not cancer and you should be five to six only. Okay? Yeah. Okay, so. And then uh, this is a few, we said, a few things. I find I put animal protein uh, because I encounter problem with my patient. I tell them that uh, you should not take the any more protein. No, 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 I don't eat chicken, I don't eat beef. I eat only fish. I eat egg. Huh? Egg and fish is not animal protein? Oh, yeah, I say, say, okay, they finally agree. That's why I don't put animal protein. I don't put meat, okay? Okay, so because uh, they confuse. Uh, okay, yeah, okay. And then too much chemical in the flower food. All of you here. Eat bagel, eat bread, eat pasta, eat noodle, eat cake. Okay? In my book, in my first Chinese book, I write down all this flower food. No matter it's organic or whatever. One is a flower. They always get the coma in there. And coma is the one they grow the cyst the tumor, okay? So, so that's why um, those chemicals in the flour. And then the people say, but I love, uh, I'm Caucasian, I love bread. How I do? I said, yeah, I, I have, I, 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 I live French a long time. I know the friend family, how they do. The family house, wife, wake up earlier and make the bread themselves. They ground it one day before, ground it the, the wheat, ground it themselves, and then the dough, and then cover it with the cheesecloth, and then next day they put it in the oven and do it. And then they finish it in the breakfast. Whatever left behind, they give to the burger, put in the front, in the front door, okay? Let the burger uh, beggar to come to take it. If they don't give to the people, they hide to put it for, for dinner, they will choke them to death. Or even that time, you hit the dog, dog with that. <laughs> okay? Yeah. So, so hard, you know. Now, you go, to the, you go to the store, the bread is sit there for a week, you know, still soft. What? They put the salt and chemical in there. See that how dangerous, you know. Yeah. God tell you I had to build a house in the rock, not in the soft, in the sand. Okay, yeah. So that's why. <laughs> the last part is over emotion, over stress. A lot of people living in stress, like uh, Stephen Jobs. Yeah. Everybody don't know him, right? Yeah. Yeah. Stephen Jobs. Okay. He, he, well, surely he eat the junk food, okay, yeah. But uh, he, I meant, I don't say, he probably follow a, a doctor, a nutrition doctor, he's not in very good in, 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 the, in, the, in the way of eating, okay? Uh, so that uh, he uh, tell him to eat cheese, tell him to eat egg and fish, okay? 
And then if you forget, the most important thing is the vegetables and the fruit, okay? He forget that, okay? And that's why the way he eat, he get the uh, pancreas cancer, okay? And, that. and then beside that, if just that way to eat, not necessarily cause the cancer. This is the overstress. You see how many times he get up and down, up and down? You know, every chase out of the Apple company, okay, this means by the Apple company, okay, this is stress, you know, yeah, or mad, you know. And I clear the Apple company, and now you mislead me. That kind of anger, you can you, you feel it, okay? Yeah. And then, uh, but he made, um, at the end, 56 years old, and um, left behind, sick. 56 million billions of money. Can he enjoy the? No, no he cannot enjoy. Okay, because he get the wrong the way. So this one, the, the cause, that is the to toxemia. You need to stop this kind of toxemia. If you really want to cure the cancer, you need to stop this toxemia. In the priority, the first priority, you don't get one. You will not say, oh, I don't need it. I, okay, I just follow you, Dr. Wu, in this diet. No. You need to stop this first, and then you follow my diet for cleansing. Okay. Which way? Up and down? You see? Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Right and down. Okay. Now, remedy to clean the toxemia. Okay. Surely, you already know, when we get toxemia because we don't eat according to our breath type, so we need to eat first mm -hmm. according to our breath type. And just remember to switch it to oh. SP and LP. Okay. And just put it down the And do the four-day goblet cleansing for this is my role. Okay, I have no time to, to uh, uh, elaborate for this one. Okay, I maintain to have a daily for bowel movement and drink six to twelve cup of good water. Good water means distilled water or osmosis water. And the sick people should eat the bioactive water. Okay, if you drink the distilled water or the good water, it don't work. You need to drink the bioactive water. Okay, yeah. Yeah, when you read my English book, then you'll know it. Okay, okay and then uh, you substitute the sprouted bean and organic meat or filthy. And then try to avoid flower food, use the natural grain. Relax with the chicken practice and brisk walking under strong sun. Are you scared of a strong sun? Did you when you go out, you say I put it the sun, sun protect the PS 15 or 30? Is it good? No. It's bad. Before the sun is screaming, no skin cancer, unless our ancestor, no matter your vocation is young or walking house, walking outside in the field, whole day, 12 hour, they never have skin cancer. And now your people put the sunscreen protection, whatever, and you get the skin cancer. So it is not, okay? We need a strong sun. Because the sun made the vitamin D, but the vitamin D protect your skin. Okay, protect your skin. Okay, and then uh, uh, made the, uh, the melanin under the skin, spread them evenly, make you brown color okay, under the sun. Okay, like me, I go to, uh, to China, the, 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 not that hot, but I go to India very hot, so I have a little brown, brownish, right? Not like the Indian yet, but... Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. And uh, uh, always pray God. So that's why the Christian people, when they eat, they always have uh, thanks God for the good. When you pray God to thanks God, you know that? You appreciate, you tell him that that food is good, okay, for your body, to take God's temple. Okay, that's what you wanted. Even you eat the junk food. God, we say, oh, my son, that is not the food I wanted. That's not the food I wanted. I want the food I recommend you to take it. Okay, not this one. Okay, yeah. Okay, that's where you're the thing, sir. 
And most of you know they if they drink six to eight cup of smoothie. Okay, that's the smoothie. That's the the uh, the smoothie that uh, my patient now become here. friend. Now when they come to the area, they always come prepared to me. So I have no way to eat junk food. Yeah, no way. Because uh, I have this one, I'm full already. And beside that, they buy, I tell them, they buy the food for me. They buy the sour kind for me. They know I like the sour kind. What? Not the sweet kind. Everybody, when you buy the fruit, you like sweet or you like sour? Sweet. Tell the truth. Sweet. Huh? Sweet. Sour? Sweet. You like sour? Sweet. Also, all other don't say it's like sweet, right? Okay. I tell you the truth. The cancer cell love the sweet. The cancer cell hate the sour. Okay, so you want to heal cancer, you need to eat sour fruit, like a lime, like a lemon, like a sour orange, like a sour tangerine, like a sour a strawberry, okay, a sour cherry. And then you say that there's an orange very sweet and the cherry very sweet, yeah, but don't eat the sweet, but eat the sour kind. Okay, yeah. Okay, that's what you say. Okay, because uh, the sour fruit not only put the cancer at bay, but they also kill the cancer. When you take the sour sour fruit, why the sour? Because very high in vitamin C. And the vitamin C. But what made the cancer? Because of the cancer cell cannot identify vitamin C and sugar. That's why you can use a sour fruit. Why? Because the formula of a vitamin C, which one is chemical? No better this vitamin C. Formula for vitamin C. Any of you? I think all oh, you know the formula for sugar, right? Huh? C six H twelve O O six. Okay. C six H twelve O six. There is a formula for sugar. Okay, for sugar. What is the formula for vitamin C? C6H8. H8. H8. And all six. They look almost alike. And the cancer hungry for the sugar. When they see that 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 Vitamin C in, they thought, they thought in their mind, that is the sugar. Grab it! Immediately they grab it. Ow! This vitamin C produces a lot of H2O2 of hydroxyl peroxide. This one kills cancer on spot. And it's too late. They cannot, they already put it in shoulder now. They cannot vomit it out. That's why you need to eat sour fruit. Okay. In my backyard, I plant the lime. But they grow so big, they grow like an orange. And then my neighbor also admire me. I say that, what kind of fertilizer you give them? I say that I give them the best vitamin I have from my body. To them. And I only give them once. I only give them once a week. And then they give me that too juicy, so much juicy, so thin the skin, and, and so lovely, you know. And then I, I mix it one uh, one pea with the one gallon of water. And I water them once a week. That's a really organic. And the best. <laughs> not only that, I tell you, not only if this one can make my land grow, it's the big things of orange. So the how wonderful this one will do for you. I you thinking, you open the Bible, you open the Bible Proverb, chapter 5, verse 15, and you open John 2nd, verse chapter 37 and you know how good it is this uh, this uh, medicine this uh, vitamin okay yeah okay we don't know what time go about that okay so 
you need to clean out this toxin. Okay, and now all this one you already know. So what? Six cup smoothie. How do you prepare this smoothie? Hmm? I go the wrong way? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not familiar with this one now. Okay. Oh, in the middle. Oh, put it in the middle. Alright, you come. You come in the half. Okay, no matter. Okay. The first thing is uh, you need to clean out the toxinia from the blood. Okay? And uh, you need to rescue the immune. Because uh, our body, the first after you stop dumping the food that causes the toxinia, then you need to clean it out. How you clean it? Clean up with the smoothie. Okay, and don't put in more toxin. That's the first one. Why the people come to me so successful in the cancer patient? I never say that I heal. Every people they get well, even my friend, they prepare this one, they say that you heal me. I say no. I, in all who I go, I say people all the time ask me this question. How many people come to you for help? I say at least half million. But how many people you heal them? I say I heal nobody. They say, how you say? Because I don't heal. I follow the instruction. Doctor, you come from the Greek, doseri. Doseri means what? I teach you. I'm the teacher, I teach the student. So I don't heal you. You want the treatment? You go to convention doctor. They are the expert for the treatment. But you want to teach you how to eat correctly and get well. You pay $300 for half an hour and then I give you a, a dietary and you follow exactly that, you get back. Okay, that now this one, how to make this smoothie. A lot of people ask me, why we don't just eat raw vegetable? God said that you eat the raw vegetable. Why we don't eat it? Why you have to smoothie? A lot of you also may have this question when to ask, right? Do you? Yeah, I'm sure. Because in China, I can count this problem. Again, I can use this. But unfortunately, the chief nowadays is not as the chief of our ancestor. The, our ancestor have a tiger fame. Tiger chief. Tiger fame. They go fame, right? They go fame. They have tiger fame. But our chief so soft. We eat the soft stuff too much. We eat the bread, we eat pasta, we eat noodles, chicken, the soft stuff. So that's why our teeth have no more strength. No more strength. So that you cannot ground the raw vegetables. Why vegetables? You have to ground it so much. Because uh, all the medicine is uh, inside the skin and inside the seed. When you eat the broccoli, where is those medicines stay? Not in the forehead. It's on the... Did you eat that? Yes. No, you threw them away. Yes, I know some people eat it. Yeah, okay. And then uh, even you eat it, you peel out the outside and then eat it. Because you, have, you can kind of break it. Cannot break it. Go home and try it. Cannot break it, okay? Okay. But our ancestors can. We cannot. Because we have no strength in our teeth. Now, those are what happened. And now, God put the medicine under the skin. And then, so when you eat the apple, you peel away the skin. When you eat the apple until the middle, you see the seed, you throw away the seed. So one apple a day, keep the doctor away, never become true. Because what? The medicine is there. You threw them away. Okay? How our ancestors, one apple a day, keep the doctor away, that should become true. And now it's not become true. Because we cannot break the seed. We cannot break the skin. And you are saying that now, I, I dare not to eat skin because they are vaccine. They, they have so much uh, a chemical on the skin. Okay, but you don't eat skin, but at least you eat the seed. Okay, you eat the seed. 
What the seed so marvelous? What the skin so marvelous? God put the seed and and the seed and skin, the medicine in there. What is the medicine? Phytochemical. Leads to the phytochemical. There is to the natural medicine that all the researchers, scientific researchers, thinking that is the cure of the 21st century. And he will heal forever the cancer. Okay? And those researchers find out the truth. One carrot has 385 phytochemical. There are not one phytochemical, one, one kind of medicine. But we have 385 kinds of phytochemical. One tomato, at the time I write my first book, we have 490 of phytochemical. But now I just read the researcher. They find out 1,000 kinds of phytochemical. But they only know a few, like a tomato, they feel the lycopene, okay, that's the one you know it, yeah. And then they rush all those researchers, rush to extract out the lycopene, and they tell you this one can kill the cancer. And then the Finnish uh, doctors, uh, they are well, I mean, to prove it real work or not, they put into the, the the cancer patient, it don't work. Why? Because God has put 1,000 kind of phytochemical in the tomato. God is not only put lycopene. Lycopene is the one, the, the, the main ingredient, but they need the cofactor. Co they need the other, other thing to help make it effective. That's why when you eat tomato, you need to eat skin, and you need to eat seed. When you eat apple, you need to eat skin, and you need to eat seed. Okay? Yeah. And a lot of people ask me, how about kiwi? When I eat kiwi, I have to eat also skin and the seed. I say, come on, <laughs> come on, God give you the brain, and God give you the wisdom. He tried to talk to you, son, daughter, don't eat the kiwi skin. That's why I put the hair over there. <laughs> okay. That's why when you eat chicken, you don't eat the, the feather. Okay, okay. And you eat the pot, you know, you eat the hair. Okay, yeah, that's what they say. Okay, yeah, same thing. Okay, one, I see in the seed, a lot of people will put the, the peaches, cherry in the blender, blend it. I said, that's wrong. When you eat the nectarine, what do you have inside? You have the pig, right? Not the seed. You have a pig. P-I-T. You have the pig. What inside the pig? The seed. So you eat the pig. God said you eat seed. God never said you eat pig. <laughs> That's why any time you have a pig in there, you have to break it. Break it up. Okay? Then you can eat inside. Okay? Eat inside. Okay? Yeah. So the one, so the cherry, small cherry, that's pig. So you need to break it. You are from Mesa. How can God put some, like an apple, they put seed? How come on the, an the avocado, they put seed? And how come nectarine or, or cherry they, they, uh, or plum, they put the pit? Now, nobody knows. But the researcher, curious, you should find out, well, actually, like a plum in the pit, the seed in the plum, the, in the pit of the plum, they can heal the chest pain better than what the medicine of a nitroglycerin. So bad. But this is very poisonous. If you have no chest pain, you eat it, you, have, you will have chest pain. That's the theory of the homeopathy. Whatever that causes the pain is the one that will heal the homeopathic theory. Whatever your pain, then you will heal that, that thing. Okay, that's why God puts very slightly. You have to 
you now you know you have the issue, and then put in his in pit. You have to ask a wiser, a wise man, a sage man. They know better. Okay, why? Okay, then you know better. Okay, yeah. So that's why. Okay, now that like a monarch. Okay, now the Santi know that they are omega three, so it's good for a heart. But what God have to put in the in the pig in the shell, hard shell? Okay, yeah, because uh, this one also is uh, dangerous if uh, uh, people eat too much. Okay, yeah. okay, and it's very good for uh, for the brain, but it's dangerous to eat too much. Okay, yeah. So that uh, we need to uh, cleanse it, the toxemia, smooth it, the supplier, uh, the prevalence of phytochemicals. Okay. So it's just the farming kind of chemical that will heal your body. That will heal your body. Okay, yeah. So that's why we need to our teeth no 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 strength. Myself, my teeth, I have no strength either. But that what I tell the, my, my patient to do, no matter your strength or not, one the smooth thing is only to cleansing the blood and rescue the immune system. But it don't supply because those you have two carrot, one tomato, uh, two tomato, one bean, and asparagus, all this kind. Nutrition not enough. This is only used for cleansing the blood, the toxemia, and the rescue the immune system. But the fire order, you still need to eat sara. You still need to eat sara. But then you have not enough teeth, not enough strong. So how? Each mouthful you need to chew 40 times. Chew. Oh, don't do Time is money. <laughs> 40 times I have to, to spend two hours. You know, doctor, you, you may have an hour, you made 300, so one hour is, a, is a 600 euros, 1,200. <laughs> That's true. Time is money. But who give you this 1,200? You buy. If you are sick, can you make 1,200? No. So, your body is a money-maker machine. It's a money-making machine. It's wonderful. If you know how to use this machine, you can become a millionaire. Actually, I am. But, all, but unfortunately, I now live only in social security. Why? Because all the money I make, my wife spent 80%. <laughs> to the charity, to the office, to the senior center, to the wedding. And I'm, I'm never unhappy. I'm very happy. Because the way she do is good. Okay. I, I always say, uh, tell my wife, I say that you will really do a good job for that. Because uh, you keep me lighter. When I'm lighter, I can fly to the heaven. But when I carry too heavy, all the money, you know, I go to the hell. <laughs> okay, yeah. That's when I want to go to heaven. Spread money to the people. Okay, the people. But how is it? A lot of people ask me, Doctor, you know, I'm not real very rich, but you charge 300 too much. And then, but I need to charge this one so that my wife can do the charity. Okay? Yeah. And besides that, when my wife do charity, that's good charity for you. Okay? Yeah. So that's what I do. Okay. I, the reason I learned this lesson only five years later, five years from now. Because I usually order pastor and high monk come to my office, it's free of charge. I give them this. I put some the rule. Pastor and, and the high monk is free of charge. But one thing is that if they have a heart disease or have a cholesterol or they have a cancer, they come to me. Very curious is that they have a so high spirit, God's blessing, because they are pastor, but they never get well. 
I'm so curious. Then, one day, I kneel out to ask God before I go to bed. I say to God, they are your servant. I want to help them. How come you let them die? And you then are the lay people. They survive even seriously than them. I don't understand. Then when I sleep, I see in a dream, one white, white, white cloth of men give money to the people. And everybody, they well, when they give the bread to the people, it's a few, a few great. Okay. So, I'm going to wake up. Okay. I understand, thanks God. You give, you receive. I have to get them paid. So now I let everybody pay. And then, <laughs> that's, when I say this story, this time in China, I went after this one, they pay 10,000, okay? But this a whole day, okay? You are waiting two hours. Now, how much was it? Almost, right? Oh, I will have now, very right? quickly. Then, uh, I, uh, each people they come to me in China is a uh, uh, 3,000 ribbon pay. Means uh, about 500 US dollars. And then, beside that, they give a red envelope. I said, no, that's enough. Do you, you already do your, your, your part. Okay? They said, no, this is for your wife to do the charity. I opened the red envelope, 10,000 Roman pay. Beside that, 3,000. Because they receive the message. The more you give, the more you receive. Okay? Yeah. That's what we have to understand. The, all everything, everything God said in the Bible is true. Okay? Yeah. So that's why now I did. And then one... And uh, five years ago, one of the uh, pastor had a colon cancer, and then uh, uh, his church follower insists he have to come to see me. And then uh, he comes to see me and said, uh, what's the schedule? He said, well, the schedule two weeks later. I said, uh, well, I explained to him. I said that you are pastor, so you are servant of God. The body is God's temple. You supposed to protect God's temple. So that God can stand inside. And you destroy, you open your camera, you destroy God's temple. Okay? Now I give you four months. You cleansing the toxin now. And if the cancer is still there, do you have a, a Western medicine, have a chemo, radiation, or surgery? I recommend if surgery is still there. I request you don't accept chemo, don't accept radiation, but accept surgery. If you will, you are cleansing. So your blood is very clean. So that if they operate it, they spray a little bit, but you think the smooth thing is you get cleansing. So every will be okay forever. Okay? And then they understand. He understand. He follow four months, he go to check, no cancer. Okay? Yeah. Okay, so at this pastor. Now she's so old, retired, and then uh, still uh, remember me every time when I see he see me all the time in church and me. I don't remember uh, his name. I don't remember anything. We have so many patients I cannot remember. Okay, but I know the face. I know he's somebody. But I know. Okay, yeah. Okay, and then uh, so that's why the the smoothie is really important. Smoothie. The first thing is that when you have cancer, you should not find look for the treatment. Look up why you have cancer. Now you know why. It's a toxemia. It's a uh, immune malfunction. So you need to cleanse the toxemia with a smoothie and then uh, rescue the immune function. Because the immune system and the healing system is the two best doctors of the world. And you need to give to what they need is a phytochemical. What they need is phytochemical. And then uh, why would all the time people get sick? Because you don't get the phytochemical. You eat the raw food, you won't chew. Have one big plate, 10 minutes or 15 minutes, finish already. No, you need to eat two hours. Chew each mouthful 40 times. Okay, in my book, I write up here. And how about smoothie? Do you like this one? In my book, I'm afraid people drink it, they don't stop. So I then use a straw. Use a straw and mouth food. Why? Because every food you put in the mouth, you have to let the brain know what you are eating. Mm. 
when you see a smoothie, see, because it's so smoothie, so you, you don't need to, to chill, you just swallow, you get trouble. Then the, the food, the smoothie go to the stomach, they sit there waiting the brain to give instruction where to go, what for. Okay, so you, you drink it, you chew 10 times, the bacteria, the patalin, the body in the saliva, that's a messenger. They stand, they tell, they already see message, they check it, they tell the brain, this is to cleansing the blood and rescue the immune. So the brain will go to tell, hey, immune system, hey, healing system, wake up, waiting for the food. Yeah. So ready there, to, if you take it, then they will see right away. Otherwise, they have to sit there waiting for instruction. And then that's why a lot of people eat a smoothie. Oh, they say, oh, I have a stomach cramp. Oh, I have a lot of gases. I have a um, uh, discomfort. My stomach don't accept, don't, don't like a smoothie. All this happen. Why? Because the food sit there too long. They don't know. They're waiting for instruction. They ferment it. They become rancid, they become bad, bad food. Okay? Okay. Now, okay, so uh, to rescue two best uh, doctor. And now, when take, you take this smoothie, this smoothie, a lot of people at the, at the, because they say that doctor who said the nut are good, they add the nut, they add the all kind of nut in there. No, wrong. The, you want to cleanse the blood, you have to be totally alkaline. And when you eat the nut and the seed, that is uh, acid. So it comes out of there. So you have only vegetables and sour fruit, not sweet fruit. You eat sweet fruit, sweet fruit is acid, only sour fruit. So you, it's also we were mentioned, green apple, kiwi, strawberry, all kind of blackberry, blackcurrant, all this kind of sour kind, okay? Sour gravy, or you have acai, okay? Okay, all these sort of, or markets, okay, all this kind of sour kind, or cherry, okay, and then sour kind, okay, or cranberry, or all this, and then they put in the body, become alkaline, okay? And then, but our body, when you get cancer, you need a lot of protein. And that's a convention the doctor tell you. You need to eat a lot of protein. And you ask, doctor, I don't know what it means, protein. Chicken, big pot. And then they eat it, they send it to hell. Because the cancer, people should not eat any more protein because this is acid. And you, your body get cancer because your body too acid, too much toxemia. Toxemia is acid. And you eat more, more toxemia, so you get more toxin. So you get, you, you die. Okay, now, but they didn't, the doctor, they tell some part is true. The cancer patient need a lot of protein. And where we get protein? We get protein from the nut, raw nut. We get protein from the sprouted beans. Sprouted beans, okay? A lot of people misunderstand sprouted bean and bean sprout. No, bean sprout is a vegetable. Sprouted bean is the beans, they just germinated. That's a sprouted bean. Now, when this, this germ, they come out, they throw the, the bean, want this germ become a tree. So immediately, this tree cannot digest protein. They can only digest amino acid. So that enzyme in the brain will convert the protein to amino acid. Mm -hmm. And amino acid, okay, converted, when you take it, absorb right away to your body. Okay, okay. And then that's, that's why the way, they, and then the, the beans is acid, but the sprouted bean is alkaline. <coughs> so you are called for uh, provided amino acid, protein, alkaline to your body. Okay, so you need a lot of protein that comes from sprouted bean. 
uh, from the, uh, the subject. So you substitute strong pain for any more protein or anything for cancer. So even you are blood type A, B or O, you can eat some animal protein. Right? We just say you have to eat according to your protein, right? According to your blood type, right? But when you have cancer, means your body already too acid. You need to temporarily stop. Go back to the type A. 100% raw, 100% and, uh, and uh, vegetable. Because you cannot add on more vegetable. Uh, after nine months, you go to CD condition no more, and you go blood test of the zero, then at that time, you are free, feel free to go back to your blood type. If you don't go back to your blood type, then you'll get sick with another disease. Okay, yeah. Okay, so a lot of people say that I'm totally vegetarian. I say, what, what's your blood type? I'm type O. Okay, you get trouble. I say that, how long you take it? I take for 10 years. Okay, the use is you get forget something. Yeah, it happened. Sometimes I forget my way, my put my car, my way, my way, my way. Tell me. I say, that is because your blood type is O. You need some animal protein. At least once per week. That's what I do. I'm O. I get once per week. You can eat two times a week, three times a week, no problem. Because type O got permitted to eat. But I just make my body happy. And I eat one time a week. Okay, yeah, that's what. You can do it, okay? Yeah. And then uh, if you eat, you're supposed to be in 100% um, vegetable. And then people have cancer when it happens to blood type A, and you know that you have to eat 100% vegetables. The blood type A is the one that heals the cancer the faster. Faster than A, B, B, O. Okay? But the O is the one cell who get disease. But they get cancer, they get trouble. Because they are, they are stubborn. They even get angry. And the angry is all stress, all emotion. And that is a, the emotion is 50 times more toxic than the wrong food you eat. Okay, and that's, that's why still job, wrong, wrong food, and also emotion. Okay, yeah, that's why I get that. Okay, yeah. Okay, so, how much time we have? Yeah, we still have time. How much time? Okay. Yeah. So, smoothie, okay, yeah. Okay, no, up, this one? Okay. Okay. I go the wrong way, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You see, I'm not familiar with this kind of stuff, you know. Okay. But a lot of people curious to know why the cancer patient they come to Dr. Wu, they heal. How come they come to an other natural doctor, they don't heal? They say that this is something circular because Dr. Wu know the Qigong. Okay? It's not. Yeah, I know the Qigong. But it's not because me, because I never heal any person. Because I teach. I teach you how. So that you know how. Now supposing you have a okay, the the easy thing to do is yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. The easier to do is that if uh, Lady have a breast. They sometimes very painful, they don't even know. Now try to use uh, your finger, press the tip, the tip of the breast. Press very hard. I see it really painful. Let's do it. The lady. <laughs> no one? Okay, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> the, the reason is that I, I want to do what I will show who feel painful they come up. Then I will show you that immediate I just need to touch a certain switch, and then not too late, because they tell me in 10 minutes. <laughs> okay, yeah. So that's why. But all the patients, they come to me, okay, after the lecture, you want the consultation, okay, it's a 300 dollars, but I will tell you, before you follow my program, do this blood test. These are three groups, okay? And then, uh, and, uh, after they do, then 
you will go to follow my my diet for nine months. <coughs> my, my, my diet is what? It's a smoothie, raw vegetable, and supplement. Why supplement? Can I just take supplement without doing it? No. This is the most important, clean the toxin out. The vegetable support the nutrition for five organs. And the supplement, supplement is the penalty for your transgression, your diet. <laughs> it's a penalty. So you need to pay the penalty. If you don't pay the penalty, you get the traffic that will police touch you, you, you can drive. Come on, wait. <laughs> Something happened. The money. You need to pay the penalty. Okay, for nine months, six months, nine months, depend. Okay, yeah. Okay, so and that, but with this, why American Convention doctor, they don't do that. This is uh, the you to do this, to know this cancer market, you need to draw the blood and test it. Every year your people have a blood test, right? How come they test a lot of things for nothing? They, I tell them that you need to test this one. I can know you have cancer. I can know you have a heart problem. I can know you have cancer or I can know you have a, have a toxin in your body. I know from these things, I know your problem. Which area you have cancer? Why your CT scan test is still getting see? I can see by the way from here. Okay? And how you call it, this one, well, maybe a lot of lecture. This, for today, this one is a one week uh, workshop. Okay? One week every day. 12, 8 hours for one week, okay? Yeah. So now you don't need to mind. In the video, I'm going to tell you to test that and to know it, okay? And then, you, when you follow this one, you know it. And then, people say that, now I have no cancer. But, how can... How, how can I know, how can I... No five year or ten year or fifteen year before to know I have cancer or not. Also through this protest. So easy. But you have problem. There's no problem for people now in China, in Hong Kong, in Taiwan, in Malaysia, in Thailand. But they have a problem here. When you know this cancer marker are already uh, relevant, uh, re relevant marker. You go to them, I want to tell this one, you need the prescription from doctor. And you go to doctors, they say that, why you do this? You have no cancer. They will do for you. So you have a lot of obstacles. So you need to fight yourself, to fight yourself. Or you need to find out a doctor. The first thing you go, I have a one, one cancer patient from Los Angeles, they come all the way up to see me. I said, you need to test this one before you come to me. Otherwise, you waste your money. Okay, they want to take. They have kinds of insurance, so they can insure. They have two people come together. One can say, don't do anything. The other one, they say that they show them the book. They show them the book. They, they show them the book. I don't know. Okay, they show them the book. This one, the doctor write out. He said, I don't read Chinese. Okay, I read for you. Okay, this one. They say, they take this one. Then they know how bad is my, my cancer. <coughs> and then so they agree to do. You have to pay by yourself. You should more pay. Yeah, no problem. What I want is I need a test. So they bring out the test for me. So I, I see it, and then I say that the first thing, you are not terminal cancer as uh, they say. Okay, you are not terminal cancer. I expect, okay, first thing. Second thing is, uh, what caused you cancer from here? I see here, okay, you you must be have blood type A. He said, yes, I'm blood type A. Okay, you're blood type A. You're not supposed to eat any more protein, and you're not supposed to eat flour food. You are eating that too much. That is the cause. Okay, yeah. I see the left foot at the tip of the shoe and so I see it, I see that. I see all this. That's why I say, tell them. And then they follow my diet. Bingo. No more. The blood test, no, you cannot see. It's not here. It's because the doctor says, see this, get all normal. Okay, even the blood test, after the test, they read it, they told them the doctor is normal. When they come to me, all are not normal. What? For, we just take an example for, for example, for CA. CA stands for what? CA stands for cancer, embryonic entitation. Means uh, when they draw the blood, when they draw the blood, if uh, you have a cancer in your body, anyway in your body, okay, then you show up. Okay? But the normal range for convention doctor is a 0 to 5. And then, this lady showed 2.5.
So they go ask doctor, doctor say that's normal. For you, it's normal, not normal. Tell me. No. If you have no cancer in your blood, you should be zero. So that's when the Bible write out our natural range is zero. The maximum is zero point five. The maximum zero to zero point five. Okay, yeah, but zero is better. Okay, now you are all have number one or one point one over two, so you are number. But when your CA is under three, it's never terminal. Why your doctor tell you it's terminal? Okay, I said that if terminal the CA has at least ten up, twenty, thirty, but you are only under three. So it's not okay. So that's why from the from the the blood test we know everything. No secret. One of uh, the patient just emailed me, Doctor Wu, I follow exactly what you tell me to do. The supplement I agreed to pay, and the blood test come out CA from 2.4 increase to 3.5, CFPA 3 increase to 3.8. And then LAT from uh, 120 increased to 160. Oh, what that? And then he said he followed exactly what I tell him to do. Now I explained to him. I but the except the AST and ALT, they are normally is the 38 and 35. Now it's 25 and 20. And GGT is 20. Now it's 17. So except the the body toxin go down. That is to know the body toxin, the body go down. So I tell them, you need try very hard to take my diet. But unfortunately, you still having you know flour food. That because of the uh, ALP tell me, so that you still take it, okay? More or less, I don't know. But the LHP tell me that you still eat animal protein. I probably you misunderstand. You don't eat chicken, you don't eat meat, but you eat drinks, maybe meat, meat soup. You see, a lot of people say, I drink soup only, I don't eat meat, you know? Yeah, meat soup is an animal protein, okay? That's why. Okay, I explain all to him, okay? To him. That's why you have, you have to understand. From here, we can see everything very clear. What kind of problem? Which area you have a cancer? We know right away. Okay. If you don't have cancer, don't think. If it is the first group, you see, show up more than one, so that you have cancer in your body. What cause? The second group tell you the cause, and the third group tell you where. See that? How come your convention doctor don't do that? Because uh, the school tell that the cancer marker is uh, uncertain. Sometimes give false positive or false negative. So it cannot be it cannot be used as a diagnosis tool. And the doctor in the education, the teacher teacher, the medical doctor, the, the future doctor, student that cannot use it as medical thing. You can use it as a reference. But unfortunately, when you have breast cancer, they only test for breast cancer CA 515.3. They don't test anything else. How can they know you have the cancer still in your body or not? One of the lady before operation, that doctor had a test for breast CA 15.3. And then it saw 16. And then convention rate is 35. Then our natural way should be zero, right? But uh, at that time he don't know me yet. Okay, he go to the doctor say 16 and then uh, uh, I need to do biopsy, they do biopsy, they check it if we need a medina, so that they need to cut off the whole thing, okay, and the chemo, everything. After everything, doctor say that the CT scan, perfect, everything is normal, no one can see anything. But the doctor say that to prove to you, make the test for CA1513. When they show up, 16. Before, 16. After? 16. Doctor said, what happened? They don't, they can find out. So this one, this time, this lady come to me, they bring me the record, and then I take off the shoe and so I look at the food. I said, no, your cancer forces 
the cancer fossil is not in the press. That's why it never changes. Your cancer, your main cancer area, the primary cancer area is your ovary. Go to check. They go to check. CA125, 65. No more, the, uh, uh, the convention range is uh, 37, 60. And then they know, doctor tell this lady, you need to operation right away. They need scare to death, operation right away, and then come back to see me again. I say that, why do you do that? Okay, yeah. yeah. Okay. So they, uh, they come to me, so I, I tell them to do first increasing the toxemia, increase the immune function, everything. Okay, and now, now, this one, okay, now, and then, uh, uh, this is yesterday's uh, about high blood pressure, uh, cholesterol, and diabetes, okay, and today's they also recording, you can read, huh? Yeah, huh? Okay, and then you also have Chico month today, Chico practice, you don't follow it, you can buy it and read it, okay? Yeah, huh? Okay, no, no, it's time, it's over. Okay, no, okay. no, no, no. Anybody? Yeah. 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 Yeah.